I like to think that our technology, although it can be quite implemented quite elegantly, is a disrupt disruptive technology and that is actually changing how chemical analysis is done. Uh, by really maturing our technology, uh, we have a vision of really changing the paradigm, traditional paradigm of how chemical analysis is done. So right now it's done through you know, sort of brute, brute force method where each solid sample is completely dissolved in a acid solution. Uh, that solution is treated several times, heated, uh, you know, samples are digested, purified, uh, and in the process it really generates a lot of toxic waste, uh, it takes time, um, it requires special scientists. So it, we're trying to change how all that complicated process can be really simplified. The way I look at our technology, it's transformational in terms of the opportunity to replace the way the world has done chemistry for the last hundreds of years, where you dissolve samples in acid and takes you a few days to get a analysis. In our case, we just hit something, anything, with a laser beam, and we get an immediate answer of what the chemistry is of that particular sample. Wet chemistry have the disadvantage of producing a lot of waste, and a lot of that waste sometimes goes back to, to the environment, uh, causing, causing a lot of damage. So LIPS, um, using laser for chemical analysis, offer one of the biggest advantages you can find out there. For, for analytical chemistry and for elemental analysis, which is there's no waste generated. I got interested in this field because LIPS is a very uh, green technology doing chemical analysis. It generates almost no chemical waste and almost no sample preparation will be required. Our research uh, is a powerful platform now. Our knowledge that we've accumulated is a powerful platform for us to really add value to society how to really improve the way the, the chemical analysis is done today. And we feel that, you know, basically LIPS and LAICPMS together um, offers opportunity for us to really eliminate all the toxic waste, uh, really improve the time that it takes to do chemical analysis. Um, so in a way, we are trying to take advantage of what we are doing, what we have done in terms of research and try to really go one step further in using that to commercialize technology that will benefit uh, the society.